Hello YouTube, David Sash Thomas here and welcome to another character showcast. Now in today's showcast, I will be showcasting the OC of Liz Productions 5784. And here is a OC of the Thomas and Friends community, Liz the Blue Saddle Tank Engine. Now the reason I'm making this character showcast is because on the 1st of August it was Liz's birthday. So, you can call this a late birthday present, and also, this video is dedicated to Liz herself. So, this is for you, Liz. Now, let me give you some background on Liz. Liz used to work on the Great Western Railway near Oxford and Didcot as a shunter, but she was also the Thomas of the Great Western, meaning that she wanted to see the world, and one night, she got her chance. One night, Liz snuck out of the yard and went on this incredible journey. However, one thing I didn't mention about Liz's journey that it was, was that it was during dieselization, meaning that Abraham Van Helsing and his diesel shunters were out hunting for any steam engines who haven't been bought or preserved. But thankfully, Liz didn't run into Van Helsing or any of his shunters. While on her journey, Liz found herself at the scrapyard at Eastley Works. As she puffed past the sidings of old rustic engines, she found herself face to face with an old Stania 8F who was painted blue and had the powers of hypnosis. If you've seen Liz's Journey or Mr. A the Hedgehog's 1996's A Cruel Irony special, you would know who I'm talking about. Thankfully, Liz got away from that evil 8F but found herself lost on British railways. But luckily, she was found by an old engine. He took Liz somewhere she could, where she could be safe. The East Lancashire Railway, where Liz met my OC, David the Blue E2. David showed Liz the ropes on the railway, and during those times, the two blue engines fell in love. They would spend endless nights to talking about their lives. That was, until Liz had been bought by the fat controller that was until Liz had been bought by the fat controller. It was hard for Liz to leave, but she promised David that they would see each other again. And indeed, they did. But that is a story for another day. Well, this concludes today's character showcast. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And I look forward to seeing you all again soon. Until then, cheers.